Universal. You'll pick a square. I'll ask the star in the square a question. The star in the square will answer the question. You will then either agree or disagree with their answer. If you guess correctly, you get the square. Guess wrong, however, and your opponent gets the square. So be careful. You win the round if you manage to line up three squares in a line, a column, or diagonally. You can also win if you get any five squares on the board. You must get the winning square yourself. You cannot win if your opponent guesses wrong. Whichever contestant wins two rounds, wins the game, and goes into the bonus round. Let's start round one. Pick a square, X. Jeffrey Tambor. When Pamela Anderson complained to Jane Magazine about an article they did on her, what did the magazine give Pam to make her feel better? A year's subscription. <laughs> it's a good magazine. <laughs> A general amnesty. <laughs> I'd like to buy a vowel. No, we don't do that here. I would imagine they gave her um, some sort of apology. Do you know the answer? You're right. Select a square, Circle. Chris! Oops! No good. Pick a square, X. Michelle, for the win. What cereal features mostly famous athletes on the front of its box? Give us your verdict. Wheaties. X gets the square, wins the round, and a thousand dollars. You've won a round, but that's not enough to win the game. You gotta win one more. Second round of play now. Your turn, X. Where are you gonna go? Matthew, Paris is the capital of which country? Do you think that's a bluff? A grant. Right you are. Circle, your turn to choose a square. Jeffrey Tambor. Yes, you got it right. Your turn, X. Kathleen. That's today's secret square. If you guess correctly, you'll win a bonus $1,000. What is the name of the fictional TV show on TV's 30 Rock? What's your choice? TGS with Tracy Jordan. Well done. Which square, Circle? Chris, you lose that square. X, select the square. Rhonda for the win. What is the reality TV show Project Runway about? Do you think that's a bluff? Designers. X gets the square, wins the round, and a thousand dollars. You did it. You've won your second round, and now you have a chance at the bonus. Let's start. In the bonus round, we'll ask each celebrity a question. We'll go through all nine celebrities in order. As usual, you'll either agree or disagree with their answer. You have a limited amount of time to go through all the celebrities' answers. If you look over there, you'll see nine keys. The grand prize is hidden inside this chest. Only one of the keys is able to unlock the chest. Each time you correctly agree or disagree with the star, we'll remove one of the wrong keys. After you've gone through all the stars, you'll have to pick the key you believe will open the chest. Who owns the factory in the book Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? What do you say? Agree or disagree? Nice work. In which city did the TV show Cheers take place? What do you say? Agree or dis- Nice work. The character Thumper is from what Disney movie? Do you agree or do you disagree? Got it. Paul Bettany, Adrian Brody, Steve Carell, and Robin Williams all wanted to play the Joker in The Dark Knight. Who did play the Joker? Do you agree or disagree? Good job. What sculpted character is sitting on a mushroom in Central Park, along with the March Hare, Dormouse, Cheshire Cat, and Mad Hatter? Do you know the answer? Got it! Popeye's strength came from eating what iron-rich source of vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin E, vitamin K, and magnesium? Let's have your selection. Agree, you're right! 
Fergie's Glamorous was the third single off of which 2006 album? Make your choice. Agree or well done. Gene Roddenberry created which landmark TV show in 1966? Do you think that's a bluff? Well done. Josh Radner and Neil Patrick Harris can be seen in which TV show? Do you agree or that's your square? All done. Let's head over to the Keys. A perfect run. Nice play. The only key remaining must be the correct key. Pick it up. Let's go over to the chest and unlock it. Yes, you've got the correct key. Well done. Congratulations. See you next time on Hollywood Square. And $1,000. Don't worry, this is only the first round you lost. You can still win the game. Get ready for our second round. Circle, it's your turn to play. Chris for the block. Oops, no good. Select a square. X Richard for the win. What is known as the city that never sleeps? Are they bluffing or New York? X gets the square, wins the round, and a thousand dollars. One round down, one round to go. Good luck. Round three, this is your last chance to win. Where do you want to go, X? Jeffrey Tambor. What's Mr. Rogers' first name? Unfortunately, Ginger. <laughs> I love Fred Rogers. What's your choice? You got it. Which square do you want, Circle? Nancy, good job. Chris, if you want a wish to come true, fold an origami of this animal. Actually, fold a thousand of them. What animal is it? What do you say? Agree or disagree? It's a crane. You're correct. Your turn, Circle. Where will you? Richard, for the block. You lose that square. Next, Richard, for the win. In the Harry Potter series, who owns the wand shop? Do you think that's a bluff? Mr. Olivan. X gets the square, wins the round, and a thousand dollars. This is the second round you won today. This means you're going into the bonus round. Let's start. In the bonus round, one song was so popular that when the master recording was damaged, Bing Crosby had to re-record it in 1947. Do you agree? Good choice. What show ended with an episode called The Truth, in which Fox Mulder returns to the show and defends himself during a secret trial by proving an alien conspiracy? Do you agree? Good choice. What vegetable is the base ingredient for gazpacho soup? What do you think? Oops, no good. Which subspecies of tiger is the largest? Agree or disagree? Right you are! What 2001 film served as Anne Hathaway's first prominent acting role? Do you agree or do you? Yes, indeed. What was the name of Al Pacino's character in The Godfather? Do you think that's a bluff? You lose that square. What award was Akon nominated for in December of 2006? Do you know the answer? That's the right choice. For whom was the Ben & Jerry flavor Cherry Garcia name? Make your choice. Agree or disagree? You're incorrect. What cheese is usually orange in color? What do you think? Sorry. All right, time to check out the keys. A grand total of five good answers. Great. Five keys are removed. All right, now select a key. Let's see if you pick the correct key. No, sorry, that's not the correct key. The good news is, we'll give you $500 for each good answer in the bonus round. This adds up to $2,500. Your total winnings come up to... Congratulations. See you next time on Hollywood Square.